This video is about activating or deactivating a slide. So I have now logged into the CMS and slides are located in the information area. So I'm now through to the information area and you can see sections in this area are slides and buildings. So I'm going to select a slide. Here is our list of slides. Uh, these are the references set for the administrator. So to open a slide for editing, I can click on my reference. But importantly, to start with, you can see that all the slides in the list are actually set to be active and that means that they are part of an EDS cycle and if these slides are active they are included in the cycle. So I'm going to take uh, for example this slide here called Green Credentials which you can see at the moment is active that means it's visible on EDF cycles for the AU Ibri uh, a building or and rather the reserve EDS cycle. So to open the slide I click on my reference. Here's a preview of the slide that's available in that particular uh, cycle. So on every slide, you'll see here on the top of the form, there is actually a checkbox to activate the record. So if I uncheck the checkbox and click update and close that particular slide, what you can see now is that the green credential slide is not active, it's been deactivated, so it would not be included in the cycles for AU, Ebri or reserve buildings. So not active but still present in the cycle, so if necessary or if required I could go back to green credentials and carry out the opposite of the operation I've just undertaken by clicking on the checkbox for yes and clicking update and at that point as I go back to the listing you can see that for this slide I have activated the slide. So slides can be activated or deactivated, uh, required activated, not required, deactivated.